Every day, more than 200 Americans are diagnosed with genital herpes. About one in four adults over the age of 30 has been infected with the virus that causes genital herpes. Some people become infected and never know they're infected. Dr. Thomas Heinemann says that's one reason the infection is such a problem. Even people with undiagnosed or asymptomatic herpes can spread it to uh, people who've never been infected, and those people can then have symptoms. He's hoping to reduce the number of cases with a vaccine made from a protein that is part of the herpes virus. It stimulates the body's immune response to the virus. This vaccine uh, may be the may prove to be the first vaccine of any sort to prevent a sexually transmitted disease. Early studies suggest it only works in women, and that it's effective 75 percent of the time. We're going your right arm. Today, Rachel Hecox is getting her third and final shot to be fully vaccinated. She's glad to be part of this research. Right now, there is no cure for it, so it's important to find a vaccination in order to prevent the spread of the disease. I think it would just give you the peace of mind that you won't contract something that cannot be cured and that you could spread to others. Dr. Heinemann is hopeful. It's a lot of fun to be able to, to participate in these big studies where you actually have a sense that, that what you're doing makes a difference. This is Jennifer Matthews reporting.